welcome, 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 welcome. This is your Chewy Dave, Dave, Dave podcast. Glad you joined me. I had more updates. This is more than we suddenly realized. There's more information come to light with Mill Weaver. Now, this is not negative or anything towards her or anything like that. But uh, let, me, let me just, let me put it in perspective. This is like twist and turns. Not only she got, <laughs> she got out of jail, there's some uh, shady people in her life. Uh, what I'm getting, what I'm getting, some, there's more story to this than meets the eye, folks. This is, I kid you not. Listen to me very carefully, little shady people in the background. She was doing a documentary. I won't mention documentary name, uh, but I said it in previous videos. Uh, two videos, that matter. Um, she's, uh, she's, been, uh, she's been around now. I don't know if the stories are true now. This is, uh, yeah, take it as it will, as they say. But uh, one of her other best friends, um, I don't know, the Tory girl that was on one of her videos there, I don't know who that who that girl was. I thought it was uh, Mill Weaver's friend from the from the documentary thing. But anyway, anyway, that's no here, no there, as they always say. But anyway, we're moving on here on this one. Anyway, this other girl uh, who has been friends with uh, Mill, uh, Mill, I say Millie Weaver, according to her name, uh, been friends with uh, Caitlin Benton, if I can pronounce her name properly. Caitlin Benton, they both... They both were on Infowars. They were both working for Alex Jones, and they, and they, I don't know, for some strange reason, they go in solo in their careers. Uh, different careers, different lives, lifestyles. Um, she, uh, she's not going to, it's not, she's trying to sound off of her best friend, Mill Weaver's rest. That recently, she got arrested on Friday, but she didn't know what she got arrested for. There's more story to this than meets the eye, folks. This is kids, you not. Kids, you not. Now, not all those people are bad people. These are not bad people that she hangs around with. Just little shady people in her life. Okay, little shady people. That's all I'm going to stress. Just uh, that's all I'm going to say out there. I'm not, you know, it's just here and almost there. But uh, according to her friend, Caitlin Benton, if I, if that's her name, uh, she, uh, she, t she works with, uh, she used to work with uh, Millie Weaver and used to uh, become, a long time ago, used to be become her friend. So anyway, you'll have to see it in this thumbnail video about this other girl who once hold her, well, apparently hold her baby. That's what she said in this video. Anyway, anyway, there's more story to this to her arrest than meets the eye, folks. Now, we don't know, there's a lot of twists and turns in the story, uh, we're, what I'm getting, so bear this in mind, I'm just sound off just like uh, Caitlin Benton is, but I'm just going to go into short way, short uh, ways of uh, saying about this. This is just, to try to sign off, because uh, apparently recently she got arrested, recently, which a lot of you people on YouTube know. They all, they all thought it was stemmed by her documentary. That's why she got arrested for it, and thus the, uh, uh, that she got. But anyway, there's more to this than meets the eye, folks. I kid you not. Not everybody's bad and shady. Uh, uh, some people be around with shady people. I quite, sometimes I do question a lot of friends sometimes, uh, a lot of shady people. Um, but, you know, they're not always bad. They're not always bad people when they're, you know, born and everything. <laughs> As you mentioned, unless you're Hitler in the in the 1940s. But anyway, nonetheless, um, if I can pronounce her name, Kate Bentley, you'll see it on the thumbnail video. Um, Kate and Bentley, okay, well, anyway, you'll have to see it on the thumbnail video. Anyway, she's signing off of Neil Weaver's arrest, which which she was dumbfounded on that amateur video. Uh, and then uh, there were so many things. Anyway, anyway. So this other friend of hers, I think it's one of her friends, but the documentary just has to do with the deep state. I'm pretty sure it was. That was my thought, uh, seeing this doc preview. And my my notion, I was thinking because of the deep state, you know, sometimes in government, it's a bit shady in the government. Not, I'm not m mentioning names in government because there's, there's a lot of them that were shady in the government. But the, uh, government people like to say everything in the world and not get in trouble for it. You know, these are government people, mind you. These are people in the House of Judiciary. They say a lot of things, but they don't get arrested for it. They don't say, oh, this guy did this, this guy did this. No, we're all here, you know, uh, witnessing all this. This is great. This is great. We can share this. We can share this. But the government people don't get arrested for saying all this crap stuff. Uh, 
but yeah, uh, they, they, people think that they got a hold of them accountable, but they're not really going to do that. But anyway, never mind. That's not to do with the government. It has to do with these two individuals, per, people. Um, uh, Caitlin Betton, I'm trying to say it nicely, and uh, if, if that's how she pronounces it. Um, soon enough, of Mill Weaver's arrest, which you people seen on YouTube videos. People, YouTubers came, well, really, I don't know if came to arrest you, but really did some research to, uh, on her and her husband, according to what I'm hearing. Um, now, her husband was never shown on any of the videos, but she has a husband, and uh, she mentioned on the emotional video, this is what I've heard from her words, this is not mental words, she says her kids, or children, or whatever it was. Um, but that was her words, I'm not mental words, this is, I'm not taking sides of anybody on this, I'm just hearing what I hear on the headphones. Uh, so she was very emotional on that video, and uh, it was just, I don't know, she was almost about to cry, I don't know why she almost did. Uh, but anyway, um, when I'm here, I don't know if this is all true or anything about that. This is a, apparently, a, there's a big story. Uh, it's more than meets the eye kind of story. Uh, there's more things behind the scenes that we realize. It's not just no Weaver. We're not saying to her that she did all the problems to this. Uh, I think there's other shady people around her, just, uh, you know, surrounding her. Uh, we don't know this. We don't know this. As they say, uh, as they say in the court systems, they say, uh, you know, uh, what's, I was forgetting now what to say about this. Uh, uh, but anyway, until proven is just kind of thing, you know. But I'm not going to say it here, folks. I'm not a lawyer. I'm not. I'm not here for the lawyer for the uh, parents of this Mill Weaver lady. I'm just here to really see, because I, I was dumbfounded like other people out there, why she got arrested. So, as they as they quietly did, the uh, YouTube is a so-called YouTube community would, come, would uh, research all this stuff and see why she got arrested, why, what was the what was the whole idea that she got arrested for, because people want to know, you know, as the old saying goes, people want to know. So, this guy, one of the YouTube videos. I don't know what his name was, but anyway, he, he dug deep, and he really dug deep good. Um, so, and it went on and on. Now we're hearing this, the husband, I wouldn't say bad, but a little shady, and, and uh, you know, that uh, Mill Weaver might not know. Uh, but uh, I don't know if this is true or not. I don't know. I'm just, I'm hearing what I'm hearing through my headphones. Uh, with these people saying this, uh, this is not my saying, this is them saying on their own videos, uh, this is, remember people, this is their videos, they're making their talking points about what led to Mill Weaver's arrest. Um, so anyway, anyway, I heard a bit about the husband that she was with, uh, but not, not, it was a bit shady on that story. Uh, but anyway, never mind, she meant about their children on that emotional video, but now, here's her other friend. This is her, actually, I can, I sense that it was, she's doing, a, 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 well, how do you say it, a, from the best interest of Mill Weaver. She's been around, what the friend is saying, that she's been around with shady people is what I'm hearing. I don't know if this is a true story or not, folks. This is what I'm hearing from my headphones. Um, I'm not making this up. Go in the video and hear about it. Uh, so, there you go. I will put this, I'll put the two people that I mentioned. Mill Weaver and Kate Benton. They were apparently uh, Kate Benton was her friend for quite a while. That's what she said on this on her videos here, which I'm going to show in a minute. Uh, not in a minute, but the thumbnail video. I will show it that. But she said in her own YouTube video about it. Um, so yeah, she's signing off her, her one of her best friends, of, of Mill Weaver. Um, and there you go, folks. So it's. I think Mill Weaver is a good woman. I think she's really a good one. But she's, apparently when I'm hearing, she sounds, surrounds herself with negativity. Uh, but she was working on documentary. It was all a bit confusing. I'm not rushing the judgment here, folks. It's just a bit confusing. All sorts. Uh, but all I, all I, uh, all I uh, saw was the stem of that, that arrest from that amateur video that Mill Weaver was holding her phone about. Um, and uh, she was a bit confused about her arrest, like uh, like the amateur video said. Um, so anyway, YouTubers got uh, they went 
did dig in to see wh why she got arrested. Why? What's the uh, the whole? Because <laughs> at first, you know, when when I see these videos, when I see these amateur videos, I kind of run to judgment and stuff. I'm trying to think why these people get arrested, sort of thing. Uh, so yeah. So anyway, it's like a puzzle for me. It's like a puzzle, like investigation, sort of thing. Uh, so. Anyway, we don't come to these people's rescue. We just help them out. We just help them out. That's all we do from this point on. We help them out. That's all we do. And if YouTubers want to help her out, that's up to her. She wants to be helped about all this. But YouTuber did come out, uh, did, uh, well, did, did some research why she got arrested. She was a bit confused herself. I kid you not on her own amateur video. So we, we kind of did some dig deep in about the, why she got arrested and everything. So we did answer, we tried to answer some answers here, folks. Because uh, it was, a, apparently it was a big deal. Uh, we all thought, we saw, we all thought it stems with the documentary, but now we're hearing it's not. Uh, but, uh, but you guys can figure out one of my videos about what, uh, what uh, doc document they were working on with her. But yeah, it was, I, I clearly thought I, I clearly thought it was a deep six. So I always I always point to that because it was the, always the government thing. Uh, but you never want to do a documentary unless everything's an up and up, like everything's cleared by the lawyers, and you can do this film kind of thing. You know, you really got to clear with the lawyers if you're going to do a film like that with the deep state. Anything to do with the government, you got to clear it with your lawyers. See if it's a okay to say this. I, I said this on the previous video. It's like a it's like a traffic light theory. You know, green light, you go. You can say anything that's okay. We cleared it with our lawyers, kind of thing. You know, like we do a little caution. We try not to. We try not to say the things that we should not say. And red light says full stop. Don't say anything about it. Just go on with other things, but don't say anything about it, kind of thing. So it's like a traffic light theory. And I'm, uh, it, I, 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 I say it like that with these people sometimes. Um, so green light, you can talk everything. We cleared it with the lawyers. You're, it's a green light. Go, go, go ahead and say thank you. And. Um, so I'm going to run with the story that I'm hearing. I'm not saying anything. Nobody, Nobody's negative to this. And nobody's, you know, um, there's more story to this kind of thing. And I'm just saying there's more story to this than we were led on to with Mill Weaver. Um, it's not to do with her. It's not to do with her. just want to put that out there for anybody. It's to do with shady people that she's surrounding herself with. That's what I'm getting a sense of on this video. Uh, but we, we, we'll pray for her. We'll definitely pray for her. Um, I hope Mill Weaver knows her best judgment. That's what I'm saying to Mill Weaver. Uh, I hope she knows her best judgment. I just want to say to you, if you her best judgment, you got to hope for the best judgment. It's like when I say when I say to police people in video, YouTube videos and stuff, I always say, I hope they're doing their best judgment. I hope they know what they're doing, what they're getting themselves in kind of thing. Uh, so anyway, uh, we'll, just, we'll just look at... Uh, as I said, it's like a traffic light theory in these people. You know, green light, you can talk all about it. We clear it with our lawyers our, and stuff like that. We can talk about it. And yellow light means we're a little cautious what we're going to say. And red light means full stop, don't say anything about it. Uh, so that's, it's kind of like the traffic light theory. Uh, and uh, yeah, yeah. So it's like a green light means you clear it with your lawyers. You can say all this stuff because it's everything. Every every party is up and up and all this, which she's going to say on this on this film thing. Uh, so she, she's got uh, you know the who does to do this kind of thing. You know you have the check marks on the check box uh, theory. Also that as well. Uh, so you know so you're not getting yourself in trouble or in hot water kind of th theory. Uh, so you're not getting trouble by the police or you know the lawyers to the judges. You're not getting any trouble by that. So it's green light mean you can say anything you want. We we cleared it with our lawyers. We can go on this film and say whatever we need to say because we looked at the sheets. We looked at the people are going to say anything. We cleared it with our lawyers. So it's like a traffic light theory. Um, cautious, uh, like if you see a traffic light and you drive around your vehicles. Uh, caution light would be that yellow light, the middle light on the traffic light. It's like uh, caution. Take a little cautious about it. What you're saying. And that's what, that's kind of approach I want to take it for these people. Um, and red light means full stop. Don't talk about. It. You can tell. You can talk about other things, but don't talk about that one kind of thing. Like that. It's like that. It's a, tra a traffic light theory. Uh, Green light says we cleared it with our lawyers. That's okay. You can talk about the length if you want. 
you got the check marks of the box saying, hey, so go, 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 go. No. Uh, it's sort of like that in a way of speech kind of thing. Uh, you're okay because we cleared it with the lawyers, cleared with the, you know, the police people and the judges. Go ahead. So anyway, we're talking about this uh, mill waiver. Her friend, her other friend, uh, Caitlin Bennett, she used to be her friend at one point. That's what she said in her video. Now, that's some words here, folks. That's what she said in this video. But anyway, uh, she once was her friend a long time ago. She even, uh, uh, herself. But anyway, anyway, you guys see the video. I'll put the thumbnail up there. I hope no Weavers did see this. Um, maybe, uh, maybe one of these days they'll bury the hatchet with, uh, Caleb Benton and then uh, everything will, you know, be okay, you know. You know, it's like a traffic light theory for everybody in this world. Everybody in this world is like a traffic light. Green means to go. You can talk about it. It'll clear it with the lawyers. It's like checking the checkbox. Uh, and you go right ahead and do the film. Go ahead and do the film. It's okay. It's okay. We clear it with the lawyers. And that's it. That's it. So, folks, this will be a thumbnail. I'm sorry it's a little bit long, but I want to I talk. I was I really not almost going to talk, talk about this, but one of her other best friends who really was her true friend with her, with two mill weaver, is sounding off on her, uh, on her arrest and a lot of other things. To, well, anyway, see the video, you'll understand. But anyway, I'm not going to let on what they what she said on that video, but I'm just saying she got she said in her own words. She just said on her own words. That's all. That's all. Um, so go no weaver, go and see this video, and you'll understand what your other friend is saying about about you and your uh, friends you hang around with. I'm not saying it in a negative way. I'm just saying there might be a little shady. You know, I don't know if this story is really true, folks. Just I'm, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna leave it up to you people out there. Uh, but I will. I will disable the comments and up, when I upload this. I'll disable the comments. Uh, I don't want any hate uh, comments on my side of things. Uh, just see the video, just see the thumbnail video, you'll understand what I'm talking about, okay? Or hear the audio. You'll see what I'm saying. But anyway, there you go, Mill Weaver. If you're out there, Mill Weaver, this is your other friend who's uh, being your true friend. And, uh, you know, it's like my friend. I, 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 My friend is long gone in the world, and it's really sad. It really is. It's almost two years long gone. But enough said of me. Uh, but I will say this, uh, there's a lot of true friends out there, Bill Weaver, just stick around, just stay around with them, and they're going to be true, and, uh, yeah, uh, the film was, I think this uh, film, uh, what she was making, I think it was all had to do with the deep state, I think, uh, you got to be careful with government people sometimes, you really got to be careful what they say, because we're usually with her in the, the U.S. Uh, Senate or the U.S. House, it's okay for them to say that. It's okay for them to say that because they get uh, they get questions sometimes. They really do get questions sometimes, but they don't get arrested. They don't get like in jail or anything. Just you know, silly things. They don't get punished for doing that. But anyway, never, never mind. But there you go, folks. I'm not here for her uh, her rescue or trying to help help the cause or help the uh, thing of Neil Weaver. I'm just I'm just putting it out there for anybody to listen to what I'm saying. Here, I'm not taking sides of anybody. I'm not taking sides of anybody. Just so you understand, people, this is not taking anybody's side. I'm just hearing what I heard on the first time I saw it. I just, uh, this is stems way back to the video that Mill Weaver had about her arrest and everything. That stems from that. Um, but, um, and, uh, yeah, and then she had an emotional video, which I put on my YouTube videos. And um, I got that, and I just said a little bit about that one. Uh, so here's, here's her other friend. She's sounding off, but she's saying it in a friendly way. She's saying it in a friendly way, if you know what I mean. As a friend to friend, you know, not evil friend, friend, friend kind of thing. Uh, but friend to her. And, uh, but no, we ever, you know, she's getting in hot water about this whole, uh, shadow game. <laughs> you know, you know. With all those shows, <laughs> uh, he had past, uh, uh, videos about, about, uh, about a lot of things, but uh, it's not to do with anything negative. It's Alex Jones just to do stuff about about the police state being the police state that it already is. It's it becoming like that at the at, nowadays because due to all the shootings that's happening. That's Alex Jones. He's he done a film about uh, the so-called police state video uh, that the United States become that. And there's a video out there about that. It talks about it in length. Uh, Alex Jones he. 
he did the video himself with a camera person narrate the damn thing. Um, so yeah, in the states there's a police state going on. Uh, I don't know if you what part of belief you believe in, but yeah, also did a video about police state, about the uh, way the police is handling everything in the world. Um, so the title on his one of his videos is called Police State. That means every city has become a police state. Uh, it's become so heavily, um, all because of the shootings going on, all the black people getting shoot at or shot at. Uh, it's become a police state. And Alex Jones did one a long time. This is a long, long time ago when everything was just going out of hand. Um, and yeah, yeah. So he made a video about the police state. That's Alex Jones from the Infowars, the head honcho of the studio. Uh, he did several films about the police state and all sorts of stuff. And what governments are doing behind the scenes, he did a DVD about it. Uh, but uh, he didn't get in trouble for it. He just uh, did his own videos, and uh, he, uh, probably he cleared it with some lawyers. And uh, that's it. So, so, folks, there you go, folks. I will give you the benefit of the doubt. This Kate Bennett is this true friend that she is. I can sense that she's a true friend to Mill Weaver. She's selling off on her best, one of her best friends from back then. And uh, she is a true friend. Uh, uh, I got to admit, uh, I don't laugh at these people the heck of it. I see that, uh, you know, a true friend would say, okay, we're, we're best friends and stuff. But anyway, never mind. I'm going to, I'm rambling off, folks, but anyway, just listen to me very carefully. So, uh, Kim Ben just sound off for Mill Weaver's arrest. That's what I'm saying on the title there. Um, so anyway, there you go, folks. That's it. I thought it was the uh, document that she was working on. This where I was hearing way back. Uh, she was working on some uh, shadow game by the government. But apparently it's not. I don't know if this is true or not, but it's not. I, when I looked at it, when I looked at the preview, uh, it looked okay. It looked okay. They were talking about all sorts of things about the government, about the ins and outs of the government, what, you know, that is not talked about in public. And uh, sometimes that can be a little shady. That can be a little shady as, as well, too. Uh, but it's just, it's, it's kind of like sounding an alarm. It's like open up the floodgates what government's not telling you about kind of thing. That theory, as I would say. Uh, they're not even telling you out there. And everything's not always always uh, out in public, out in the world, that people can understand. Uh, sometimes government things are main private, as they would say, in terms of government stuff. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, being pu uh, pri uh, private to the public doesn't want to see it or hear about it. Uh, but other things that's uh, on public, yeah, people can assume all that and, you know, take whatever it wants in every direction. But there you go, folks. Anyway, we're going to be right here. By the way, that's it, folks. See ya.